students are asked in a survey, they are asked two questions. One is, um, how happy are you? And the other one is, how many dates do you have off? And I think the answer is the first two questions. And the truth is, it depends on the order in which you ask. So if you ask happiness first, and a date in second, the correlation Turn the order around, the correlation is about as high as it can be, it's 0.66. What is happening? Deciding how happy you are is really a difficult question. <laughs> but you are already in a mood where you've been asked to deny how many dates you have. You are momentarily either pleased with yourself or not so pleased with yourself. You're in a mood. You're asked a related question how happy are you with, with your life in general? You already know, and that's what you get. Here's another question. You know, in the period when there was a fair amount of terrorism in Europe, uh, the following experiment was run. They asked people about travel insurance. They used to sell travel insurance just next, next to the airport you could buy travel insurance. And the question was, how much would you be willing to pay for an insurance policy that pays $100,000 for death for any reason during it. Now, did you see what they can find? Then people get asked the question, other people get asked the question, how much would you pay for a policy that pays $100,000 in case of death in a terrorist incident during the war? Now, people pay a lot more for the second policy than they pay for the first. Now, why is it? Because the question of how much you would pay for insurance is very different. But there is a much easier question. How afraid are you when I mention dying? And how afraid are you when I mention dying in a terrorist incident? You are more afraid of dying in a terrorist incident than of dying. That's the way we're going to get there. They small the cream and it's more specific and more detailed. We get into trouble when we import an emotion directly onto a statement of economic value, because then it violates the logic of economic value, which imposes, which imposes these rules. So the general rule is a rule of substitution. Very often, when you try to answer a question, you do not answer the correct question. You answer it differently. It's related. But you don't know you're doing it, because the substitution is itself an operation system of economic value. It's an operation.